The crankshaft is an important part in the structure of machines and engines. It converts the piston's reciprocating motion into rotational motion. The crankshaft has a large proportion, accounting for 25 to 30 percent of the engine cost. Often used in water pumps, generators, driving wheels of cars and tractors, it is manufactured with very complex high precision, so milling and turning machines must also be very modern to meet the requirements. With the utmost rigor so the following steps must be followed. step before machining, straighten the crankshaft blank to ensure the straightness of the shaft. Select manufacturing materials, the crankshaft must withstand bending, torsion and abrasion at the shaft neck. Usually use chromium, nickel and steel alloys. process of machining a two-axis crankshaft using a five-axis milling lathe Niles and 20MCX2000. First, design the details of the crankshaft on CAD software. From the CAD file, generate code, code, to program the CNC machine. Code contains machine control commands to perform machining. Set up the CNC machine, set the jig to fix the crankshaft workpiece on the machine. Install the suitable cutter for machining. Proceed to production, the CNC machine will perform turning, milling, drilling, and other machining operations based on the programmed code. Ensure the accuracy and quality of the crankshaft after machining. Correct fixture position, make sure the fixture is placed in the correct position on the machine table. This requires precision in placing and positioning the crankshaft blank. Firm fixation ability. The fixture must be designed to firmly fix the crankshaft workpiece, avoiding cases where the workpiece is misaligned or the cutter cannot be positioned correctly. Safety, the fixture must not endanger the operator or damage the crankshaft workpiece. Make sure that the jig does not cause impact or injury. Convenience in installation and disassembly, the mounting bracket is designed to easily install and disassemble the crankshaft blank. This helps increase efficiency and save time during the machining process.
Prepare the right type of cutting knife. Place the right type of cutting knife, knife holder, and tightening handle on a piece of felt, wood or soft plastic on the machine table, then clean the taper barrel in the spindle. Install the cutter, place the drawbar into the hole on the spindle head. Clean the taper and keyway on the knife holder. Place the tip of the tool holder on the bottom of the spindle, press in and rotate until the keyway lines up with the key in the spindle. Hold the knife holder head up with one hand, with the other hand insert the pull bar clockwise into the knife holder head about 4 turns. Screw the draw bar onto the cutter head by hand, hold the brake lever and tighten the draw bar as tight as possible then check again, make sure the cutter is installed correctly and securely, next perform the cutting operation from the jig knife to check operation. <laughs> Structure of the crankshaft, crankshaft end, the crankshaft end is often equipped with a lug for starting or rotating. A torsional damper can be installed. Crankshaft neck, hollowed out to accommodate lubricating oil and camshaft drive gears. Also be installed. Crank pin, precision machine for enhanced rigidity. The number of crank pins is equal to the number of engine cylinders. Crankshaft has an elliptical shape to distribute stress properly. Counterweight, balances the unbalanced force and moment of inertia of the engine, crankshaft tail, transmission place output capacity. After completion, check again to ensure the crankshaft has been machined correctly and safely. <laughs>